Greetings to my team of 144 all star seeds, light workers, and way showers. Thank you for joining me today. Hope you're having a beautiful day. It is 2 28, 2019, the last day of February. What a wild and crazy month we had. We're still in the G1 solar storm here, so many people are experiencing different uh, ascension symptoms. Some people are having releases and some people are feeling relieved. So be sure to sh share what uh, you're experiencing in the comments below this video. You can see what other people are experiencing, some challenges and some releases here. <coughs> Let's see, I'd l like to also give a little shout out here to M and Miss M. Their seventh seal summit has been uh, released today. It, it will be on July 5th through 7th, 2019 at the Creative Life Center at 333 Schnebly Hill, Sedona, Arizona. Uh, there'll be speakers. Uh, there's going to be people there like Clifford Mahudi, Tolik from Dakota, Suzanne Ross, Let's see, Lightstar, and many other speakers. So I'll, I'll put a link in the description below this video. And full disclosure, it is an affiliate link, so I'll receive a commission if you click on my link and purchase the tickets. I'd appreciate that. Also, from Unity Grace, uh, she was did a... Um, transmission last night and talked about how the uh, sun is now in this 37th gene key 37 is key here the 37th the 37 is a is a sacred number 73 and 37 so let's see the the 37th gene key is from weakness to tenderness <clears throat> it is the mother is the place of infinite tenderness where all members of the family can return to rest and remember their essence and purpose so the key or the foundation of the 37th gene key is to remember your essence and your purpose your true essence The mother is a feeling of safety and trust that allows all human beings to excel. The, thir the 37th Siddhi, or Siddha, speaks into this great mystery of the mo mother essence. Tenderness is a collective fire engendered through mutual compassion fanned by the winds of grace and carrying the transformative power of truth. So it's a very powerful key. Also, I'd like to share today the latest transmission from Michael Love and the Pleiadians. Sorry, I'm having a little issue here with technology today. So the event, the powerful energetic wave impacting Earth. Pleiadian Life Forces Transmission 2272019, channeled by Michael Love. Begin transmission. Great ones, you are most likely feeling the powerful effects of a super energy wave that hit the Earth today. A chaotic mix of energies is still bombarding the planet and our auric fields into the evening hours. We are currently experiencing a moderate geomagnetic storm, multiple 40 hertz, central sun, gamma spikes, a wave of matrix mayhem. The green areas on the chart are showing a dissonance carrier wave created by two dimensions clashing into each other. This offset chaotic wave is showing up now on other space weather charts as well as around the planet now. 
Even the most advanced star seeds are reporting moderate and chaotic waves of energy pulsing through their layered bodies today. Light forces have communicated that the new 40 Hz light matrix is beginning is being retrofitted on top of the old matrix and as this happens Earth's magnetic field is being stretched to the limit. We are in the midst of a cosmic storm, great ones, while all of this transpires. At this time you may feel as if you are walking between worlds, watching the old world crumble behind you and feeling a bit nervous because you are still a few feet away from the new world. This is where your inner strength and training comes in, so trust it and use it. The great central race is working all around the solar system at this hour, blasting the dark spaces of the old matrix completely out of existence and slowly replacing it all with something much more wonderful and perfect. They have said our work is not complex and is not secret. We place coded data within these light streams to completely activate all the star seeds stationed on planet Earth. These Akashic data streams also completely reveal the divine plan for humanity's great ascension. Furthermore, these shining ones have said we are physically approaching Earth now and beginning communications with the star seeds stationed on Earth who are ready to meet us. We are going to give you all the information you will need to guide humanity into the coming new Earth. A massive amount of plasma light is being built up around the Earth's sun in preparation for opening the Grand 321 Equinox Ascension Portal. These great beings have said it may seem a bit intense for a moment in the cosmic energy storm, but know that everything is as it should be. And when this is all done, you will emerge as the perfected divine being that you are. Let us know what ascension symptoms and life changes you may be experiencing. Take good care of your layered bodies during this powerful, energetic time. Godspeed, Michael and the Pleiadians. So this is Paul from PrimeDisclosure.com. Uh, you can join other light workers in the chat room at primedisclosure.com forward slash chat. Also, um, many people are experiencing intense dreams. Last night I, I had many upon many intense, very vivid dreams. It was like I lived several years within seven, eight hours. They were very vivid. It was like in that movie Inception where much time unfolded in a short period of this earth time and there was a moment this will resonate with several of you that I was looking for the girl with the colored hair to help break the time loop the prison of time this this looping of consciousness the figure eight. So thank you for joining me here today. Thank you for your support, your kindness, and for shining your light brightly into the night. I love you all. Have a beautiful day.